did we meet? We get asked that all the time. Quite a bit. Yeah, so we've been together a long time, you guys. We're going to give you all a little backstory uh, about how we met. Uh, I was like literally eight years old. I was 10 and ish. He, 10, I was 10. Yeah, yeah. You were 10, 10. You were 10. Mm -hmm. My dad was a pastor and mm -hmm. he went to pastor the church where my husband uh, was going. Mm -hmm. And uh, my grandmother used to cook yeah. for your family every yep. Sunday. Every, every Sunday, Sunday after church, y'all would come to our house. And yeah, yeah, she sure cooked. did. Sure mm -hmm. did. And uh, after we got older, you know, we would do stuff like play cards and go, go for rides, or go to the park in my car, go my little gold cutlass I had. Oh, oh yeah, this little car. He thought he was looking all good. I was cool with a capital K. <laughs> right. Had my, little, had my little curl action going on, my little <laughs> Jerry curl, California curl going right. on. Right. And he would only pick from each side and they had none in the middle. It was plenty back there. <laughs> it was plenty. Good, good, just keep talking. Cause and once we got uh, once we got in high school, you know, we started of course we we call ourselves dating mm -hmm. back in like junior high. Junior high school. But you know, in junior high, you don't you're not really dating, mm -hmm. you know. But then once we got in high school, we started dating other people. You had a little boyfriend. And, oh, why well, gotta be a little boyfriend though? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, you had a little girlfriend keep too. Moving, keep moving. And then, no, 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 don't skip over that. Then, you had a little girlfriend too, so don't even don't even try it. <laughs> then I went. I went out to college. Yeah, he we went out to college. In, I was still in high still school. Still in high school, yeah. right? And so, but while I was in college, we decided to get married. Yep, sure mm -hmm. did. We got married. Sure did. We got married September nineteen eighty seven. Nineteen eighty seven. Nineteen eighty seven. Yep. And been together you know, ever since. Rolling ever since then, by the grace of God. Yep, mm -hmm. by the grace of God. And uh, I know a lot of people ask. And then the other question we, that we get asked all the time is, how did you? How have y'all stayed together? So long. Mm -hmm. Have y'all stayed together so long? Right, right. And, you know, it, he just does everything I say. That's just you know how you stay together. How you stay together? Because he know if he doesn't, it's gonna be a problem. You let her, you let her think she's one <laughs> when it really doesn't matter. But, but on the real though, you know when people say you got to keep God in it, and but you yeah. know sometimes that can become a cliche. What does that mean? Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. But it's true. But it's, it's true. true. We get up every morning. We pray together every mm -hmm. morning. We pray together, and, um, and the, you hear people say a lot too. Uh, communication, communication. Is key. That's, mm -hmm. true. That's true. That's true. That's true. Try not to keep your feelings, you know, inside. Talk about them. We mm -hmm. talk about. Them. We try not to go to bed angry. angry. Try not to go to bed angry. Mm -hmm. When when she usually sometimes whenever we're about to go to bed angry, she'll realize I'm right, <laughs> and we'll get it worked out. <laughs> Yeah, but, right. <laughs> but even 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 when you look at Genesis in the book of Genesis, the very first lesson God taught us was when the enemy spoke to Eve, mm -hmm. and then letting somebody else speak into your marriage. Yeah, you got to yeah. keep your business, and and it's not the woman who always does that. Right, right. But right. you got to keep your your business. Your marriage is your business. Exactly. Your marriage is your business. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Exactly. And just 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 talk things out, you guys. Really talk things out. Tell your spouse how you really feel. Don't just hold it in. A lot of people hold it in until they get so angry and then just blow up, you know. Just just don't it just be honest about your feelings. You she know? don't she don't hold it in. And, <laughs> and you know what? And sometimes you have to agree to disagree. Mm -hmm. You know, and, you're not gonna agree on every single thing all the time. And accept the fact that there's always gonna be as much as you love each other. It's always going to be some stuff about each other that you just don't like. You True. think that you magically going to be on the same page all the times you right, grow. But right. when you get married, especially if you married a lot of years, you're no right. longer the person. We're not the people we were that many years ago. Exactly. After 10 exactly. years, you're not the Then you just try to yeah. make sure you're growing together. Yeah. But even when you yeah. disagree yeah. and you're not together. Yeah. And it's, I think of it as like a roller coaster. You have highs and lows, you know, in, in marriage. You know, you're going to have some, sometimes when you're up, everything's going well. Then sometimes you're going to have some low points. But you got to learn to work through those low points. And be strong for each other because when right. you go through those low points, we might not be strong at the same time. Exactly. But you can't and be both how, weak at the same time. And that's how it usually works out. Mm -hmm. It's like at a point when I'm weak, he's strong. And then at a point where he might be weak. I'm strong at that, you know, at that moment. So it works out. It works it's, out. It's, it's like, but that's by the grace of God. Even, 
as long as you have God in your marriage, it works out that way. Because he's the one that keeps you together when you're both being weak and stubborn and right. angry and, and right. don't want to communicate. Right. And that's going right. to happen. Right, exactly. It's, it's going to be sometimes where you're not going to be able to stand the fight of one another. You know, it's that's life that's going to happen. And <laughs> you mean tell me it's sometimes the way Oh, you yeah. Me, they don't believe that. They don't believe that. They don't believe that. Yeah, that, that's going to yeah. happen sometimes. Yeah, that's, that's going to happen. You yeah. know, that's, that's reality. That's, that's, reality. Mm -hmm. that's reality. But if you love one another, no matter what, you're going to be able to work through anything with God's help. And, and you know, one thing I would I always like to remember is your songs, the music that you used to listen to when you got together. Yeah. Let Keep music in your marriage. Right. Keep a little wine in your marriage. Right. Laugh. Have fun. Yep. And experience new things together. Exactly. Exactly. One little, one little fun thing is, you know how sometimes we'll do something... Like, if you do something that you both don't like. Oh, yeah. Because yeah, it, yeah. you both don't like it, but it's new. Uh, exactly. And then you can laugh and talk about it together. Yeah, you can laugh and talk about it later. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. But, you know, that's, that's basically, there's no magic formula. Right, right. Exactly. There's no magic formula. Everybody's different. And try not to look at other people's marriages. Oh, yeah, yeah. And compare. Uh, <laughs> you glad you both yeah, got it. <laughs> No, try not to compare other people's relationship to yours because you, you're only seeing, you're on the outside looking in. You don't know what that couple might be going through, mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. So try, so don't compare. Don't, don't compare, compare okay, your, your marriage to, to, to theirs because people can be a whole, you know, different, somebody can be a whole different person on, you know, on the outside. What you see mm -hmm. is not always, you know. What's, reality. What's actually, yeah, that's, yeah. that's probably true most of the time. Yeah, yeah, that's probably mm -hmm. true most of the time. Yeah, but you know, that's basically it. Yeah, that's that's our our, our advice for uh, the little 31 years we've been together. Mm -hmm. and <laughs> well, let me rephrase that. We've been together longer than we've been oh, married, married for 31 for years. For 31 years, but mm -hmm. we've been together ever since I was 8 and he was 10. Mm -hmm. And be, I, I have to say best friend. Yes, mm -hmm. actually, seriously, best friends, mm -hmm. real best friends. So, you know, I guess that's it. That's it. And we mm -hmm. hope this will bless somebody. And what we always say on our Sunday Blessing video, what is that? Be, Be blessed.